We're starting with breaking news now from your local election headquarters. Just over a week after the death of Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg, President Donald Trump has nominated Amy Coney Barrett to be her replacement. She's currently a judge for the 7th U.S. Circuit Court of Appeals. If approved by Congress, Barrett will be the youngest justice to sit on the country's highest court at the age of 48. But of course, this decision is getting a lot of backlash, too. Senator Sheldon Whitehouse speaking out on the president's nomination, questioning the rush to fill the seat. He says in part, quote, the American people overwhelmingly want the president sworn in in January to replace Justice Ginsburg. Senator Whitehouse goes on to say the Republicans ought to think twice before forcing this nomination through. Congressman Cicilline tweeting out a statement saying in part, quote, three years ago, Judge Amy Coney Barrett authored an article suggesting in a, the Affordable Care Act should be struck down. It's all on the line. The Senate should reject this nominee. Congressman Langevin also speaking out, saying in part, quote, It is deeply disappointing that as our nation continues to wrestle with the COVID-19 pandemic, President Trump has cast the need of Americans aside and is instead focusing on jamming through a Supreme Court nomination for his own political interests. Of course, we will continue following all of these developments and bring you the latest throughout the night.